I'm recording this video in order to show for Odoo how we can use an app called Few Servants in order to fulfill your requirement for the meeting record form. So in the future, your salesperson can just in a very easy and smart way to fit in all the info. And for your manager, you can have all the reporting in order to calculate how much like how much time they have spent or how frequent they have meet or how many meetings they have, etc. So mostly you can see the tab. Right now I have two schedule. So first meeting, second meeting, and you can use this to create a new one to plan ahead of the meeting. So let's say it's your third meeting. Oh, I think third meeting with um, let's say M group. So it will be automatically assigned to me because I'm the one to create the record. And if I click the customer, I can search it or yeah, just click it and the info will pump up. Same for the plan day. Let's say it's tomorrow and maybe yeah, 1 p.m. to 2 like that so I can apply. So the tag is only for your future searching or filtering. You can let's say make it like VIP, urgent or yeah etc so up to you and since it hasn't incurred any sales order so it will be it will be left empty so in the tab description and the timesheet is optional so if you need to let's say plan the hours ahead in order to for the timesheet calculation so yeah few things so you can let's say plan two hours like that so if you really incur any action and you can write under the description and how much time you have spent but I know this is optional, so that's why I just directly save it. And in here, the worksheet would, would be exactly the same as your meeting uh, report. So once I click in, so you can see for the sales person, it's already automatically fitting my name because I'm the person fully in charge. But I can also optional to maybe add in my colleague, maybe Michael and Amit, and also fit in, you know, the project value would be 5,000 and since you know again the data automatically draw from my preparation in here so that's why I also had the time the location but I still need to fit in you know the type of meeting so the logic for the attendees is the same so since Odoo we connected with the content app so if you have the database so I can just directly click that person and I can click this button in order to see the detailed info of Mary. Let's say the email, phone, company, address, blah, blah, blah. And if I have one person which is not in my contact list, so maybe he is an attendee, but not in my contact. So I can just, you know, create one right away. So maybe, I don't know, it's called YY. So I can just create and edit. Again, you know, fill in the info, email, company, like that so for the agenda you can directly type in as well as for the meeting minutes and finally the action items so once you have filled in all the info and you can save it so when you get back to the office you know feel free it's optional to have the manager or the customer to sign the report so once I click on sign report it will be in the digital format and the details is exactly the same as the you know the report that you have just filled in so your manager or your customer can sign and once they've signed and when I get back to the back end you can even send the report to the customer so again it is optional so I'm just showing you the visibility so you can have an email template with the PDF, so it looks something like this. So the PDF again is the same as the report, but just in a PDF format. So you know, feel free to send it out to your clients or print it out for internal discussion, etc. So if you don't like the design of it, if you want to change something in here, we're gonna just use an app called Studio to you know customize the design, the wording, the front, etc. But yeah, you can send it. And in the future, you're gonna have all the full record of what you have done, including, you know, all the email transfer, 
any activities that you have done and schedule as well as any attachment etc so ultimately if you go into the reporting let's say at the end of the month and you can have different tunes in order to do the calculation and the calculation may be based on the number of tasks so it would be the task is equal to the meeting so in the excel format i can see okay this month in total there will be three and if i group by the person and also look at maybe just for march okay so i don't have the yeah yeah maybe look at march or yeah february sorry should be assignation date yeah okay so you can see for this month like i have three i can even compare to last month so you do have the data and you know the report is up to you you can tailor it in real time so basically that will be you know the features of the view service and for anything that is want to be customized let's say in the future if you have the meeting report form um, in other version so you can always use the studio app in order to customize so it would be trained and it would be taught in the implementation so no worry about that because it's the most advanced app in Odoo. so yeah that would be all for you know about the meeting report so thank you so much